Wait. Wait, did you guys see this? Wait, 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 wait. R slash. Okay. Reddit moment. Should I debate my girlfriend? My girlfriend said anybody who isn't a communist just hasn't read enough theory. This is the stupidest thing I've ever heard. Destiny des destroys every leftist he debates. I've been learning debate tactics recently. Should I test them out on her next week We see when we see each other in person? I'm pretty sure I could destroy her brain-dead lefty arguments in and in in intellectually dominate her. Um, but she also is emotionally fragile, unlike me and Destiny. So she might break up with me. Is it worth it? These, yeah, these are the sorts of bad guys that good girls go for. How the fuck did this person get a girlfriend? True! I see people like this and I'm like, wait, he has a girlfriend and not me? That's the real black pill. That's the real black pill. That people like this, bonk. <laughs> <laughs> That's the real black pill right there. Anyways, with this, there's an update, okay? How good is the hand holding? I don't, it may be really good. He may be top tier. He may be top tier hand holding. Like one of those things where you like caress their um their their hand with your thumb. <sighs> Holy shit, I'm literally shaking right now. I told my GF once and for all to meet at Wendy's for a debate date. What the fuck? He's Wait, how do you sketch? <laughs> wait, wait a second. Woman, your transgressions against the neoliberal establishment hegemonic order will not pass. Meet me at noon at Wendy's for a final debate to settle your to settle your crimes against the status quo. Please, it is finally time for you to face the music for what you have done. Like what what is this at Wendy's? We we will fight at Wendy's and the intellectual battle dome will be set and our fight will be legendary. Like what are you talking about? With all that destiny has taught me, I knew that I would easily destroy her leftist delusions. Capitalism versus communism in the marketplace of ideas. The first thing I did was bring up my uh, my iPhone 11 and show her the Wikipedia article for the Haldemore. Oh no! Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait. Oh no. But okay. No. Wait a second. This has to be. This has to be parody. Please tell me this isn't real. This is a massive Reddit moment right here. No way someone would post an L this big online. No way, dude. No way. That's when she uh, brought out her uh, her completely packed bag and started pulling out really thick books on theor uh, of theory, Marx, Engels, Lenin, and a bunch of Russian and Chinese names. I can't even remember. My hands started trembling with anger. I continued to scroll down the... <laughs> I continue to scroll down the Wikipedia page of the Haldemore on my iPhone 11. <laughs> she basically said that it was all capitalist propaganda and exaggerated and that the uh, communes like uh, uh, Catalonia or something were really successful. She kept quoting these books and shoving pages in my face. I told her to stop uh, pivoting and gish galloping, uh, but she just kept going. At this point, the people at Wendy's were... <laughs> We were pointing and chuckling, and someone went, how's it going, sport, with a smirk. No one understood she was acting in bad faith and nitpicking the <laughs> clearly biased. <laughs> a young African-American stood up and said, this N-word eating beans, and everybody laughed. She hadn't really responded to any of my points on the Wikipedia article was making. Uh, at some point, I started stammering because I was so mad and how illogical she was being. And she went, I think I've won. Nice gaslighting. Jeez. She asked me if we should end it there or if I wanted to try another debate. I smiled, uh, a confident smile, and, and asked, do you, th do you think incest is inherently unethical? <laughs> No, he has a trap card. Wait a second. No, he flipped it over. Just when she thought this, the the absolute, the absolute uh, emotional roller coaster that I'm on in this in, in this uh, in this Reddit post is is something of legend. Wait a second. She said obviously, and I uh, and uh, and I asked why. She couldn't come up with an argument because she went quiet for a few seconds. I continued. There's nothing inherently wrong with being attracted to your sister. I am not. 
But then the guy uh, next to us at Wendy's broke into a loud laughter and basically said, why, why are you with this dweeb? <laughs> the guy had a really broad build and was wearing a rose t-shirt. <gasps> And he had a really thick and sturdy beard and a masculine ponytail. You're clearly more intelligent and hot than this guy. Uh, take a look at this. He showed my GF something on his Twitter. She giggled and I <laughs> I think it was a stupid commie meme or something. She basically ended it there and went to this uh, and went to this broad and sturdy guy. Uh, on the way out, I tripped on the doorstep and everyone laughed. She isn't responding to my text. And this is <laughs> five hours ago. What the fuck is? <laughs> Should I <laughs> debate gang help? <laughs> Tacoma web dude, he got cucked by Vosh. Wait, wait, no, wait, no, that is Vosh. Wait, oh no. He showed her the only thing leftists care about, your Twitter following. And she was like, oh my gosh, that's a really cool meme from OK Buddy Vosh. And he's like, huh, yeah, that subreddit's about me. <laughs> Come here, girl. And he just grabbed her by the waist. Fat Ian strikes again. No, dude. Fat Ian takes your girl. I was there, everyone laughed. Yeah, dude, he tripped, <laughs> tripped on the doorstep. And then the very broad built man with an extremely masculine ponytail stood. I saw his shadow loom over me as I was on the ground. And he said, want to hear about cobalt mines? I'm sorry, dude, but that's your own fault. As I suggested to you in your original thread, you should have started with the incest discussion to ease her into, into the debate mode to look cool and classy. <laughs> you only have yourself to blame you could have easily won by just calling her white yeah i mean that's really the debate ender right there <laughs> your main fuck up is not using notes uh, to keep track of all your points also did the guy who picked up your girl wear glasses and have keloids because that was irish laddie aka vouch don't worry brother happens to the best of us yeah I, I don't know if you've really been in the leftist circle if you haven't had your girl taken from you by uh by vouch honestly it would be more amazing if the broad guy caught him before he fell and hit the ground. Oh, yeah, dude. If he, like, caught him by his shirt and then he he fell and tripped, he caught him by his shirt. And then, uh, like, uh, he, his tears were dripping onto the floor and he, like, sniffed and turned around. And he was, he, he, ha he was holding him with one arm and he had his arm around his girl with the other arm. And he's like, hm, don't worry, buddy. <laughs> oh, man.